Hello Flutter Developers! In this tutorial, we'll be creating a custom Flutter widget for audio messages. This widget is perfect for integrating audio messages into your chat applications. Let's dive into the code and explore the key functionalities. First, we import the necessary packages, including flutter slash material, dot dart for UI components, intl4 date formatting, and audio players for handling audio playback. Additionally, we import our custom message status enum for message statuses. As we scroll down, you'll notice we have a stateful widget called audio message. This widget is designed to represent an audio message in a chat application. It takes various parameters such as the audio URL, title, status, and background colors. Now, let's break down some essential features of this widget. The underscore audio player instance is responsible for handling audio playback. We also have variables to track the current and total duration of the audio, as well as the playing state. In the init state method, we load the audio, get its total duration, and set up listeners for changes in playback position and player state. It's crucial to release resources using the dispose method when the widget is disposed. As we move on, the build method defines the UI of our widget. We use a card with a circular avatar that serves as a play slash pause button. The progress indicator visually represents the playback progress. The formatted time method ensures that the time is displayed in either 24-hour format or AM slash PM format based on the user's preference. The build time status method displays the formatted time and a status icon. For outgoing messages, the icon represents message status, whether it's sent, delivered, or read. And there you have it. A fully functional Flutter widget for handling audio messages in your chat application. Feel free to customize it further to match your app's design. Happy coding!